Dog days of summer, but that does not slow down a couple of dogs that we know. Lola and Louie have had a busy week digging up the best animal stories. Here's this week's edition of the News Hounds. It's News Hounds Now Update with Lola and Louie. This week on the News Hounds, squirrels go nuts. A sloth is born. And a baby hippo learns to swim. But first, who's a good girl? Kayla is. She's not only good, she's been named the Transportation Security Administration's cutest canine of 2020. She earned the title by getting the most likes in a social media competition. In addition to Kayla's looks, this five-year-old Visla is smart. She helps her handlers screen for potential explosives at Honolulu's International Airport. That is when she's not stealing hearts. Meet Timo. The Brookfield Zoo is introducing its newest member to the public. Timo is a seven-month-old Linnaeus' two-toed sloth. He was part of the virtual special Bringing the Zoo to You event. Visitors flock to a zoo in Paris to catch a glimpse of a newborn baby puma as well as a newborn baby sea lion. The puma cub, who does not yet have a name, was born to mom Maylie and dad Maceo. The little one is keeping its eyes closed for now. It'll open them in about 10 to 15 days. Naya, a one-month-old baby sea lion, kept close to her mother, Nora. This is the first birth of a Patagonian sea lion in a zoo in France. Speaking of keeping close to mom, the Metro Richmond Zoo is releasing video of a baby pygmy hippo's first swim. The female calf was born on July 26th, and she's the first pygmy hippo to be born at the zoo. Pygmy hippos are rare and endangered. Their survival is more certain in zoos, and that's one of the reasons the calf's arrival is so important and special. Finally, check out this custom-made treetop nut bar that allows squirrels to pound peanuts, pecans, pistachios, and plenty more to their furry little heart's content. The nutty bar is the brainchild of woodworker Duke Harmon, who came up with the idea after he got tired of squirrels stealing his bird seed. Harmon shared his meticulous building process on YouTube, which resulted in one shell of a nice nut bar that allows the crafty critters to belly up